Tom. Hello everybody, Tom Fox here. Welcome back to more Fire Emblem Three Houses. In the last episode, Edelgard declared war on Garrick Mach. And we went around talking to everybody to see what their opinions were on it. Of course, the Black Eagle House is very torn about this. As their families have sort of, you know, gone... Have been split on the, uh, on the matter of this. And I figured it'd be fitting to start the episode here. At the grave site of my mother. Because there- because in- uh, in- on top of like all the questions we have surrounding the politics of the area, there's still a lot of questions based around my origins. And like my own mother, you know, my father even, all of that. So, I'm thinking now that would be a good time to take a look at that before we end off our little exploring excursion here. So, let's proceed on. Let's instruct them manually. As this may be the last chance I have to instruct all of them. Alright, well nobody gained any new abilities just for me instructing them. So, in terms of group tasks, I think it might be a good idea to switch in Hilda and Lawrence. So we'll try that one out and let's begin our lecture. I have to ask you. Uh oh? One of your students keeps challenging. One of your students keeps challenging me to fight him, but he has no idea how to wield a sword. It's a waste of time for both of us. What am I supposed to do? Use the fighting as an opportunity to teach him. Drop a hit that needs a new training partner. That's the price of fame. You have to put up with it. Use the fight as an opportunity to teach him. I think I get it. Motivation increased. And I get a lot of professor, professor. points for that. Uh, focus on Axe of Flying Skill who excels a Wyvern Rider versus Bow and Rider Skill who excels a Bow Knight. Well, you're the one who wanted the Wyvern Rider trait in the first place, so I'm gonna say no. Continue on throughout the week. A birthday. It's Shamir's birthday. Thank you. Have some flowers, Shamir. You really know what you're doing. I bet you'll do a terrific job. For you, Hilda, I will give my best effort. Thanks so much. I'll do my best to support you. Nice job, Lawrence. I knew I could count on you this time. And next time, I hope. I am... Yeah, we keep getting... I don't know why I didn't just skip through that. Hey! Skill level up writing is now A! My efforts have borne fruit. Got a well, few skills going up effort? here. Reason went up for Flane. Seems my practice is paid off. Brawling went up for Aloise. Looks like I'm getting it. Brawling went up for Catherine. I'm getting it. Lance went up for Shamir. Could have sworn some other people were going to gain something fairly, short, uh, fairly soon as well. Raphael is A in both brawling and axes, which means he can start using um, the A rank ones, I suppose. Uh, yeah. We're all good there. However, this up and coming uh, fi final fight here, we could do a seminar, we could do a battle, we could rest, or we could explore. Were we to do a battle, there is an, uh, a battle at Grander Field. I don't think we need it. I'm gonna go ahead and do the seminar. Because I would like to try to raise Kenyu Knots. I could probably try to raise Can You Not Sword and um, Faith. Alternatively, does anybody have? I guess only yeah, only Henneman teaches reason. See, I'll go with Sword and Faith. As we all study hard at the seminar. I feel like I get it now. Faith plus one. Well, we're at the effort. Sword plus oh, one. Faith plus one. Yeah. Uh, I'm almost the A ranked of swords with Can You Not. Motivation of the attendees increased by 50. Listen up, everyone. The Imperial Army is upon us. If you can fight, pick up a weapon. Everyone else, hurry up and evacuate. We have the goddess's protection on our side. We have nothing to fear. Victory will be ours. Professor, are you ready? No. Almost. Well, hurry up. I don't need to tell you that the situation is dire. We have some support troops from the local nobles, but the army we're facing is immense. 
No matter how you look at it, you're at a disadvantage. To make matters worse, the enemy is being led by Edelgard. Do not underestimate how extraordinary her abilities are. She's back already? Talk about impatient. If we don't stop them, the Academy will be destroyed. Prepare for battle, everyone! We will stop Edelgard's rampage! Our opponent is formidable. But if we work together, we will not fail. Enough talking. Let's go! Dear Goddess, please protect us all. I shall fight with all that I have. It is an honor to fight alongside each of you. Professor, Claude, you'll lead the way, won't you? You won't let any of us fall, right? <sighs> I wanted to talk to Rhea first, but as expected, that won't be possible. What did she hope to accomplish at the Holy Tomb? What happened to you as a baby? There are still so many things I need to know. The same goes for the real origin of the Crest Stones and the Hero's Relics. As for Seros and Nemesis, just how much of their mythology is true? We know so little. It's true. But lucky for me, I refuse to die with so much still unknown. Hey, Teach. All joking aside, can we possibly survive this battle? We'll find a way. That's all we can do, right? If we gave up, the God of Fate wouldn't be happy. I'm a lot of things, but I'm not the kind of man to just roll over and die in a place like this. I have my own ambitions to see to. There are things, dreams, that I must see come to fruition. And I've been thinking, I want you to see those dreams realized as well. On top of all that, there are still so many secrets out there just waiting to be uncovered. We can't let that stand, can we? So, Teach, no, scratch that. You're so much more. You're my ally and my friend. Teach, friend, none of those words quite capture what you've come to mean to me. We may not be connected by blood, but I believe our bond goes deeper than that. Now that we know each other, our hearts are connected. Even if our paths diverge and we're forced to say goodbye, I know that we'll meet again. And so, for lack of a better word, I gratefully call you my friend. And I hold fast to the belief that this isn't it for us. No matter who or what you really are, I'll always be on your side. You can't count on much in this world, but you can count on that. Question, why isn't there an option to romance Claude as either gender? Well, we got our mission. Do we have any new certifications we want to try for? I, for one, welcome our new overlords. Uh, in actuality... Flane's already mastered hers. Dorothy M keeping his dancer. Bernadetta can't be upgraded. Leone should be fine. Hilda I kind of wanted to put in a position where she'd be on a, a horse. That way she'd be able to get the Great Knight a little bit better. I think Marianne already has everything she needs. Lysithia, Ignatz, Raphael. I think everyone's in a good position. You know what, I actually, maybe not an exam, but I do want to switch uh, switch Lawrence back to his old, um, his old class. Or rather, he hasn't, he hasn't actually upgraded to a Warlock yet. Yeah. I'm gonna make him into a, Jesus, look at look at that that sassy stance he's got with the warlock outfit on. Sassy. I'll take the two-thirds risk of him of him succeeding at this. Cause at this point he's already got the writing ability. Was there any doubt? Change him into that class. He's already got the writing ability. So, you know, it's I don't think it's gonna be too much of an issue. Uh, so we'll keep him at Warlock for now. Claude's good where he is, and Kenyonot's... Kenyonot's just gonna be Kenyonot. Let's go ahead, start our mission. The Battle of Garrig Mach. The Battle of Garrig Mach. White Clouds, Chapter 12. To War. So... We have we have allies on our side, including uh, as far as we can tell. Oh no! 
Several church soldiers are fighting on our side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten church soldiers are on our side. We ourselves have 11 units to work with and two adjutants. Our conditions are to defeat the enemy commander. Whom? Rightly so, is Edelgard. We also have uh, Ladislava here. No Hubert, however, unless I can't, unless I just don't see him on the battlefield uh, right now. Ah, there he is. Hubert wielding Banshee. Several winged demonic beasts. Two health bars there. Was there another one? Thought I saw another one. There are two. There are two demonic beasts. Both winged. Pointy Art Crescent Stone. So that will be interesting. Some of the soldiers here are trapped uh, at, at the, uh, the behest of this monster. And, oh my god, what class are- you're a warrior! Dang! You're gonna be tough to take down. Let's see exactly what Edelgard has at her disposal. We also see Randolph here. I wonder how many of these people we would have met if had we taken uh, a different road here. Let's get details on Edelgard. Her avoid is negative 10. Her hit is only 77. Having the Flame Emperor Company as her battalion. Let me see if I can take a look at that. Raging Flames. Attack that ignites certain area, uh, certain terrain in the area to flame. You can see the stats on it. Minus five to hit, minus five avoid, but great physical and magical attacks, including plus to crit, plus to resilience, plus to protect, and plus to charm. As her class is still Flame Emperor. In terms of her ability, she's got uh, Imperial Lineage still, Charm, Axe Fair, Commander, nullifies instant death effects, yep, we've been over that already, Counter Attack, that's gonna be an issue, Seal Strength and Magic, and Authority. She has a ton of Charm, good lord. What is that, what does that stat even do? The others, well, we'll learn more about them as they come along. For now, Let's go ahead and start organizing our troops. All right, here's what our troops are looking like right now. I've moved around some of the uh, some of the weapons that I have because I've mostly just been keeping up with what weapons I would normally have them. But I uh, gave some ranged weapons to some of the people who use axes. Um, I gave uh, the crescent sickle. I gave a killing edge to to Ignatz. I gave uh, I tried to upgrade uh, Lawrence, but he didn't have enough ability to wield some of the stuff there. That's the same. He's the same. I gave uh, Leone the Blessed Lance and the Crescent Sickle. So hopefully we'll be able to see some good used with that there. Dorothea is basically the same. Bernadette is the same. Cyril. I think I have Cyril with somebody. Cyril's pretty much the same as well. So. That's pretty much it. Now let's get a quick save in. And. Let's fight. Defeat the enemy commander. Uh, can you not Claude or Rhea fall in battle or the, def the defended location is captured? I have a report. The enemy is within the walls. They're about to break the defensive line. We have two priorities for this battle. Protect the Archbishop and maintain the defensive line. Reinforcements should arrive soon, so just hold your ground until then. Alright, so... Biggest thing right now is, does Rhea move? No, Rhea does not move from that spot. So, we need to be sure Ready that nothing anytime. goes wrong here. Let's start with having you come out. Silver bow, not enough to take him down. Oh, stairs! I didn't think about the stairs! I can't get, any, get much closer than this. Will a combat art help? No, he can- wait, he can hit me from there? Does he have a tomahawk? Yep, he's wielding a tomahawk. Let's get to it. We're still going for that person there. Oh, I didn't think about stairs. Well, let's see. If Ignatz gets close enough. Okay, good. Still going for <laughs> Unfortun not not great, but still better. Because he's going for... He's not going for Ignatz. 
All right, here's hoping for that critical. No crit, but we still got a decent chunk of damage in on him. Our Assassino Ignots. Wait there. Now well, let's see what we got in terms of enemy range here. Who, me? Uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and attack you with the Iron Axe. Mm, Silver Axe? Silver Axe is good. That's my cue. If we want her to do more, let's go ahead and dance. Oh, nice. Rush her in this way and finish the job. Smack, smackity smack. I'm concerned with this Crescent Soldier. Oh, never mind. I thought he was in range. Going. Oh, you plan on. Oh, Ready you plan will. on going. F oh, you silly, silly boy, you. Uh, I that stand ready. said. I do wish that I had a little bit more. Stay oh, focused. wait, I do have a bit of room to work with that. Hello! And goodbye. Have a little bit of fire sure. from the enlightened one. No, it's not going to my head. The mm. glory of the glory of progress. And the Toa continues. Oh wait, maybe combat art curved shot. Uh, even without the crit, I'd still be able to get him. Let's try to defend as many of our soldiers as possible. Defend all the adults as much as possible! Send the children in! Impregnable wall is leveled up. Oh, meanwhile, we still have... Ooh. Well, it's a good thing that not all my units are in range of that. Move Lawrence down this way. Move you down this way. And I still have a, a gaggle of units up, up here that I need to work with. Leave it to me. Oh, just out of range. What are you packing? What are you packing, big guy? 19 and 26. Raphael could easily take, he could take that in his sleep. With his steel axe tied behind his back. We'll start moving everyone else up as well, though. All right, enemy phase. Let's see how it goes. I'm sorry. Oh, there must be a ballista there. No damage. You can't hurt what is already dead. Two damage per. And charging up a big attack. Oh, I should have used, I should have brought up my tomahawk. It would have been much better. Yeah, I can tell them they got tomahawk. They got a crescent sickle. Similar to the one that I already have. Ooh, is the Death Knight here? Oh, one of the knights is dead. Hello, do you really want to try that? Allies are heading in. You... Oh, you brave yet foolish man. Okay. Okay. Not great, but... I, I can see that you're trying. Report. The enemy has taken the entrances where the reinforcements were heading. Of course. So long as we can recapture the east and west strongholds, we might be able to call in the reinforcements. Well, let's see. East and west strongholds, then. Hello, Death Knight. You're significantly less terrifying since last, last we met. And you have a dark seal. Man, how many times am I gonna switch, uh... Switch Lawrence's, uh, class this time around, huh? Eesh. So what is he using? Does he move? He does not move. Crescent Sick, uh, I'm sorry, Scythe of Sariel? Uh, Seth is the Death Knight's weapon of choice. 
How great would it be if you just dropped that? All right, uh... I can't reach the... Can't reach that. Ooh, ooh, she needs to get out of there. Uh, who would be coming? Oh, an archer would be coming that way. All right, uh, can we kill you with an iron lance? We could! Get some of that lance skill up. Good, 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 good. All right. In terms of this portion right here, uh, who needs to level up the most? Probably, probably Leone, actually. Yeah. Let's step right here and gambit. This should work. Oh yeah, the poison bomb. Forgot I had that on him. His shields aren't fully broken, but that won't be too much of a problem. Let's start by dismount. Wait, don't I have? Oh, I forgot he's got a healing one, not like a, a normal one. Well, shoot. Looks like I'm gonna have to do this the old-fashioned way. Well, let's just sm uh, smack him with an axe. Shoot him with a bow. Shoot him with a bow. Shoot him with a bow. My moment has arrived. Was it a killer bow? Uh, that break his barrier? No. Oh, I can still hit him with a bow. Hit him with a bow. Hit him with a bow. Hit him with a bow, don't you know? How do you like that? How do I like that? I like that quite a bit. Okay, as uh, as is uh, my want on this side. Oh, I didn't even. I for completely forgot about this guy. All right, so plans plans are being enacted right now. Let's get a little bit of Nosferatu action. I probably should have put Lysithia on the other side. You underestimated me. Look at you! <laughs> he sounds so sarcastic. Oh, look at you! Apologies. How's how is your progress in the dancer class going? Pretty good. Dang good. Uh, hold up. <laughs> maybe, just maybe. There we go. Perfect. Let's get the big guy healed up. Sero Sacred Monks have leveled up completely. I can hit this guy from here with a tomahawk. And kill him. And kill him. Get out of here. Yeah. Oh. Go, 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 go. Sorry. I don't know my own strength. That's a big tomahawk, I just realized. I think I've gotten stronger. Can I attack from here? No, I'm one tile out of range. Oh well. We'll keep him going that way. Uh, let's move you over this way. And let's get her out of there. <laughs> All right, who needs it? Uh, one of their soldiers kind of needs it. Appreciate it. Who else needs to go? Oh, can you not? I'll just I'll just attract everybody toward me right now. Oh, I wish I had the I wish I had uh, uh Dorothea's uh, Levin sword because I upgraded it with better range. I can't be taken on everybody at once. Although, attracting the Pegasus Knights probably wouldn't be the worst thing. Item. Let's keep, let's put, uh, we'll, keep, we'll hold on to the Bulgano. We'll equip fire though. Here comes the enemy. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting they're on the, oh that's why he's attacking him. I think not. 
not so fast. Yeah, you stop that. Oh no. Oh Lord. He's a gambit. Why did you use your- Oh my god, you guys are dumb. Alright. I need to figure out what I'm going to do here. How far can you move? I better move here. And then one, two, three, four. I think she'd be within range of, to, to attack that guy. This is definitely within range, but at a rather... Costly costs. Oh, I could just bring down Ragnarok on him. That's always an option. Rag the rock! Naturally. Naturally. As I float here before you. Naturally. Of course, they're both gonna go for her. What? Uh, let's see. That would do four. I'm trying to see like what the ballista does. I'm sorry, on a gear. His protection is 20, so it does his attack. Her protection is not great. 12, so she take 11 damage every time she got hit by one of those. Oh, if I do it from here, that wouldn't be a bad idea. I can hit him with a short spat. That wouldn't kill him. That would not kill him. Let's for to would though. Suck! I can't afford to lose. Okay, and we got a giant beastie over there. If I try to fight him head on, what are the odds of me living? Living pretty good. Living in America. If I go for Dark Spikes, then, oh man. I gotta make absolute sure that he doesn't have some kind of vantage. Cause that would suck. Assists. Oh, if only I can get, if only I could dance her back into using another move. The Infinite Dancer Combo! Seraphim would not kill. I think only Dark Spikes would do that. I forgot what Greek letter uh, is on Dark Spikes. I can hear some of you already going, Greek letter? That's clearly a T. But it, but it's not. That's the thing, it's not a T. Uh, that's the gun. Oops, I, I skipped his dialogue. Oh no! Go the knees. Well, time to turn back time! Hey, I'm just gonna play this safe, alright? This fight is but a sideshow to the ravaging of the sacred place that is Garrick Mach. I wonder if we can ever get to learn who this guy is. If that missed, I would have been upset. The time is not right. I will wait for the next opportunity. Translation, he's a really sore loser. I have to try harder. He does. We took back one of the strongholds. On to the next. Oh damn, okay. Oh! Yep, Hubert's guarding that. Okay. What does Hubert have in terms of magic? Miasma, Meyer, and Banshee. Yeah, that means he's got a really far. Let's get to it. Okay. Is that another? That's a ballista. Those are really annoying. Ready and willing. Dismount to be on the safe side. 
And you know what? Tear down this wall. Stay focused. Almost. I can almost get him. Edelgard doesn't move. I'm gonna go for the Ballistocrat. Who else do I have to move? That's my cue. Okay, hold on. So I got this. We'll move in here. Man, Raphael just can't get a break. He got killed by the Death Knight in another time. I mean, what? I mean, he got killed by the Death Knight Let in another time. I can only really do rescue from there. All right. Get that dancing ability up. Well, like what you see. It's a it's a very provocative statement considering that you're the dancer class. Uh, Ready anytime. Iggy still needs to go. Hilda still needs to go. And Leone still needs to go. To which, yeah, we can just like take this guy out with a bow. No big deal. No big deal. Pure grit. <laughs> True grit. Oh, good. She dodged it. Th thus is the way of the monk. Five damage. Not happening. No damage. Did quite a bit of damage. The allies are going. Oh, man. Th these guys are good for two things. Getting in my way and getting killed. All the ballistas are suddenly pointed at her. Oh boy. How far can I even move some of these guys? I can't even move up close enough to... Well, I can at least do it, use a combat art. I hear those guys use curved shots. No crit? A bit surprising. I'm getting better. And now it's full. What ability do you have now? Darting blow. Desperation. Full attack. If possible, occurs before. Okay. See, these are, are the things that are good to know. See, these are a few of my favorite things. I'll just take it down. If I don't kill him off, then it, then the then the, the uh, monastery troops are just gonna do something about it. Can't get comfortable. Although this guy's just gonna die straight up, like straight up going to die. Hold on, let me see what's down there first. Okay, just those two. Und wait. You over here. Uh, let's mount up and then attack. Yeah, because he can't do anything to me right now. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, you know, we'll take this. We'll take this a little bit slow. Uh, flame. How much? How much damage does this guy do? I don't think the ballista does as much damage. It does the same amount of damage. Okay, I think the range might be longer though. Uh, so Flame probably wouldn't be in the best position to be standing there. She's got plenty of health though. Her protection isn't terrible. Wait, Raphael, let's go up here and give him the punchies. One little, two little, three. Actually, just one little punchy. I was gonna say one little two, little three little punchies, but it was just one punchy. I guess hard work does pay off. Uh, 
Uh, how far can you move? You can move into there. So, I'm quite curious. Twer I, we're twer she to dance. And dance she shall. Who else? Marianne. Does anybody need? Yeah, he de uh, our, uh, our our buddy here. Everybody's good time friend, the professor, could use uh, some healing. Hopefully, I didn't put her in range of somebody else. No, but fairly close. Oh damn! I still got two more like front lines to go before I even get a chance at El at uh, Edelgard. Come over here. We'll mount up. We'll attack. Use the iron axe. Bing, bang, boom, you're dead. It was a good try. Uh. Meanwhile. I suppose I could start bringing out his front line. Uh, are there any wizards there? There is one, but he cannot reach from there. Right. I stand ready. The front lines command. Back in at the ready. What you fail to appreciate is that we have at our backs a force you cannot hope to defeat. This might explain why Hubert is has always been really creepy. Oh shoot! I didn't even see us being targeted there. Seven damage. That wasn't as nearly as bad as I thought it was going to be. Rude! I'm still a delicate flower, you know. Kick! <laughs> give! Give it back! Give me my health back! Ooh, you're a little bit stronger than I gave you credit for initially. Allies are on the way. He's retreating. Do that, please. She heals because I believe she has like a solidarity ability or something along those lines. Let's go ahead and just... Because she'll die if I don't do this. Crunch him up with a bit of my ass. Of course I won. I noticed that her seal tends to or her crest tends to activate and give me just exactly what I need. Assist. Uh I'll go ahead and use fortify. Hey, hey, let's dance all day. Boing boing. Hey, hey, let's dance all day, a boying boy. Oh man, there are so many options to punch. It's like an all you can punch buffet. Hmm. Let's give it a shot. I have no choice but to distinguish myself in this fight. I'm finished. I'm loath to say it, but I must retreat. Chances are we'll be fighting him again someday. Uh, would, would stabbing him do me good? The speed isn't right for me to stab him properly. Pointless. Pointless. You're outclassed. Still not satisfied. All right. I mean, well, let's see. Yeah, that should be fine. I'll just throw a hand axe at this guy. Excuse me, I'm walking past you, but before I go, take this. You lost to me. Did you? Did you need an axe? Cause I. Oh, you. You're good.
Uh, we'll keep using Nosferatu just to get his, um, his, uh, white magic up. Or his faith up, rather. Level 29. Another step forward. Two steps forward, I take two steps back. We come together, cause I'm healing Raphael. I guess I feel a little stronger. Right. Uh, how would you fare against Huberg? You'd get him. I can afford to fall back. We still have the advantage. I've always wondered. Boy. All right, we took back both of the strongholds. Let's keep up the momentum. <laughs> and then suddenly back attack. I guess I'll move back to uh, over here and dismount him so he doesn't get, you know, destroyed. Experience for Cloud. Progress suits me well. Yes, yes it does. Your battalion was replenished by seven. All right. We ain't gonna mess around here. Let's try out this crescent sickle. This croissant sickle. That takes care of that. Uh, I'll manage. She has. She has become death. Uh, oh, I can still move her. I'm just gonna move right here. Uh. Oh, okay. I still have you to move. We'll fortify again, just because, you know, it's super easy that way. It's just easier that way, all right? Ooh, I wasn't expecting to move out so quickly. Zero leveled up. I'll keep it up. Oh. oh, nice. We'll defend Garrig Mock if it's the last thing we do. I like how below fifty percent health is like, I'll manage. I don't want to allure Edelgard that way. I'm a bit uneasy. Wait, is he? Oh, he's very close. He's well, not close to death, but he's kind of on. He's got a bit of death in him. How close is? Can you not be able to reach him? I was thinking doing this. Yeah, that she'd stay alive. I mostly I just want to see the the interactions between her and like uh, the other students. Uh, first, let's get some interaction with you. My life was changed forever by Her Majesty. Now, I lay it on the line. For the Empire! <laughs> Lady Edelgard, I'm so sorry. I can't keep going. I must retreat. I, I can't help but laugh a little bit at like interactions like that. Huh. Ugh. Where it's just like, yes, I, I fight for I fight for king and country. Here I come, you swine. Ugh, I can't go on. I just I just it strikes me as funny as all. All right, I think I want to I want Claw to get the experience. Let me see if there's an option I have that won't kill Edelgard. I don't keep her alive as long as I don't crit. Uh, what's my least critical option? Yeah, right. Fire, uh, or Nosferatu is probably my best bet as long as I don't crit. I wish you were someone whose heart could be swayed by my words and deeds. If it were so, 
I would have done anything to make you my ally. I got all that health back and then some. And, well, there's really only one person who could take down, uh, who should be taking down, uh, the Empress. And that's the leader of the Alliance. Here she is, Her Majesty, looking pleased as a dog with a stick. What exactly happened to make you this way? I'm simply seeing through a promise I made to myself a long time ago. Isn't this much force excessive? Thanks to you, my own long-held ambitions are nearly destroyed. If you don't want them to be destroyed completely, I suggest you turn tail and flee. Claude levels up. The Wyvern Rider uh, outfit is really awesome. Raphael was the MVP, and I almost called him Percy again. You fought well, but now your fight is over. Send in our reserve troops and give my uncle the signal. What is this? Everybody here, young and old, is in your hands. <sighs> no, I will not allow another Red Canyon tragedy to happen here. going on Imperial year 1181, the new Adrestian Emperor, Edelgard von Hesfeld, led a strategic assault against the monastery at Garrig Mach. Though her own losses were great, her foes had no choice but to surrender. 
Archbishop Rhea commanded the Knights of Seros, leading from the front lines against the Imperial army. But amidst the chaos of battle, she vanished, and her whereabouts remain unknown. With this single attack, the Adrestian Empire officially launched its offensive against the Holy Kingdom of Fargus and the Leicester Alliance. The unification of Fodlin has begun. What's to happen to us? We've fallen quite far. Who knows? We now know that Rhea can turn to a giant dragon as possibly a blessing from the goddess, or maybe she is descended from, you know, a goddess bloodline herself. Edelgard has taken over the Garrick Mach, and now begins to try to conquer the entirety of the kingdom. Who knows what will come after that? Next time on Fire Emblem Three Houses. Who knows? See you all then! Later!